a lot of our clients have significant money in their IRAs, but, so, but they also have beneficiaries that are on government assistance. The problem comes that if you leave your IRA to a beneficiary that is on government assistance, they will now have more than what the government would allow them to have. For most programs, the government only allows you to have $2,000. So if you leave them more than $2,000 in your IRA, you've just disqualified them from government assistance. Particularly, the programs that, that this applies to is SSI and Medi-Cal. In other states, it's called Medicaid, but it's their insurance. So there is a way of setting up of an IRA trust in such a way that you can have the money being basically in a special needs trust so that the benefit beneficiary can still get the benefits of SSI and Medi-Cal, but not have them not get any of their IRA. They still are entitled to their IRA. They still are entitled to the government assistance. It does take some more sophisticated planning because there's some special rules as to how the income has to be accumulated. But if you want to know more about it, click below and get a copy of our pamphlet about the 10 most common mistakes people make with regards to their IRA accounts.